We have Billy Bush now. He's here to serve up today's celebrity snack from Extra. Hey, oh, Billy. And I have morning. Ashley Darby here with me today. Good morning, Billy. Hi, Ashley. Hi, Marissa. I have issue with cooking with compassion. I'm a very <laughs> angry cook. I'm throwing things around in there. I cook with fortitude and anger <laughs> and... and it, but I learned a lot here. Thank okay, well, you, you so much. Boy, those cakes look good. we have here, Billy, including leftovers, if that's the case. <laughs> <laughs> it's the place to be. This is the busiest lunch hour I've ever seen. There's always such... I can't wait to come into town. All right, that's our next promo. That's right. Thanks. Come Thanks. on in. You're always welcome. Yeah. But you're so busy there. In fact, the Jonathan Major story, I mean, he's in court today. What's the latest? Well, I'm, I, you know, listen, I always look when I, whenever I see one of these, you know, celebrity cases is how forcefully is the defense coming out? And Jonathan Major's defense team is very forcefully coming out. They just filed a motion this morning asking, you know, they didn't detail what the motion was, but I have to assume it was for dismissal of the case entirely because they provided text and, 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 and all this video that shows that really tries to defeat this woman's case before it even goes. And they, I mean, they're calling it using words like outright lies, complete fabrications. This is insanity. They're trying to get the DA in lower Manhattan to, to see it and say, okay, wow, I've got enough evidence here to just not waste my time. So that's a forceful response. Um, they've shown, you know, the, the evidence from video that shows her out that night and partying, and it shows her getting the location confused as to where they were. Lots and lots of evidence. We'll see what happens in Jonathan's case. The, 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 the prosecution has uh, till the middle of the month to reply. Got so it. that... You know, he, he still, no matter what, will be in court June 13th. He must show up in person. My oh, thing, too, I mean, Billy, when you think about it, though, the court of public opinion, I mean, his whole career has changed faster than you can say, Creed. It's true. You know, even with these allegations. So yeah. regardless of what happens, you know, we ultimately don't, don't know what will happen criminally well, that's, or professionally. That's a that's a very good point, Marissa, and it's, it's sort of what, where we live right now. No matter what, once a mountain of allegations that are so tawdry come up, I always said, look, if, if that person is innocent, as they say, and in this country you're supposed to be innocent until proven guilty, you know, when, when the big studios are looking at the roles, you know, mm -hmm. uh, are they going to go majors or are they going to go, well, there's another actor very similar, let's go with him. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Absolutely. It's, we'll be yeah. following it, it for can be sure. Yeah. Well, what else are you all working yeah. on? Well, hey, uh, there's a lots of fallout from King Charles coronation. <laughs> You've seen the song online about Camilla? Do you know the one I'm talking about? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I, I could not it, see it. What a chuckle. Ashley, Ashley, <laughs> Ashley, that hit you a little too soon, a little too authentically right there. It did. It's hysterical. It's hysterical. We've got Kate Beckinsale tonight going off on it. We didn't even ask her the question. She just started talking about it. She's a riot. She's really funny. If you follow her on Instagram, you know she's got that crazy cat and the whole yeah. thing. Mm -hmm. uh, so we got her talking about that. Harry and his book author fighting. Why was Harry even there? He left so early. We've got lip readers talking about Harry's attitude. Well, while in the house, Charles is out making appearances. The fallout there. And then, of course, Kim Zolziak Beerman from Real Housewives yes. of Atlanta. She and her husband are splitting foreclosure on the house. Money problems. They owe the IRS a million dollars. Bethany Frankel takes them mm. to ask. Don't spend money you don't have. Mm. Yeah, I remember when Kim, I can't remember his name, but I remember when they got married because he used to play for the Atlanta Falcons. And I, for one, I was shocked to see that news come mm -hmm. down yesterday. Yeah, me too. Yeah, they met in May in 2010 yeah. at Croy Beerman. Mm -hmm. And they, uh, they had four kids together. She had two prior, so she's a mom of six, four with him. And they're all under the age of 10. Yeah. Uh, so they got a busy life and a busy house, but I think they got caught up living that, you know, housewives life. Yeah. The I can't tell. The salaries they pay pressure. these people, they don't pay them a lot of money. I mean, it's not, they're not paying them millions. Yeah, you put a lot out there, <laughs> you know, true. when these things happen. So <laughs> yeah, you got to keep up appearances. Here. Look at me, I'm a housewife. <laughs> well, I want to know, too, uh, Katy Perry, the funniest thing for me of the whole coronation is her walking around looking for a seat. So if you all can get to the bottom of that, <laughs> it's like, oh, she's just like us. I know. <laughs> They're like, never mind the fact you're headlining a concert the next day. You do not have a seat, at least not yet, at the coronation. <laughs> well, I, I got my I mean, entire thank life. You. You know, Very it important. reminds me of the time I went to the Mayweather fight in Vegas, and I walked in. I didn't even have a seat. Uh -huh. I didn't have a seat. I'm going to name drop. I flew up on a plane with, uh, with Jack Nicholson. Really? And I just walked into the arena, and I was like, 
I'm with Jack. They're not going to ask me for a seat. I'm with Jack. I'm in his wake. And I go in there, and they find, I find these two empty seats. And like, quickly, before it gets embarrassing, I need to just sit in something. Those are the only two guys that didn't show up for the entire fight. They must have gotten too drunk in the hotel. Oh, I man. sat there, had a seat the whole night. You locked up anyway. <laughs> See, that's why I want to be Billy in the next life. Thank you so much, uh, Billy Bush, for joining uh, us. Lots of big stories. They always mm -hmm. do it big, too. We can they turn really into do. Extra always. Uh, just a reminder, you can catch Billy and the entire team from Extra weekdays on Fox 5+. Plus.